Hi, it's Deborah from Beacon of Light, and today is Thursday, March 21st. These two cards want to come out. So let's see what today's energy is going to be all about, or what Spirit's message is for everyone today. Way too many cards just fell out. Let's get one card here. This one. All right. First card is the Eight of Wands. Incoming information, uh, communication. Six of Coins, equal giving and receiving, benefiting. Ooh, and the devil. So, you know, um, what I'm feeling and sensing is there is a Libra lunar eclipse um, coming on Monday. And we're starting to approach that time frame where it's, you know, going into three days before the event, three days after the event, and tomorrow will be that three day time frame. But this Libra new moon or lunar eclipse is, I'm sorry, it's not, it's not a new moon. I'm sorry. It's a full, it's a full moon. It's a Libra full moon. Um, lunar eclipse. It, it's, about relationships. Libra is about relationships, balancing. It's about partnerships. Uh, it's, it can be about the relationship within, within yourself. And with this equal giving, giving or receiving, the six of coins could be almost like a balance beam. And it could be trying to weigh out the incoming information and how we interpret it. So the process we've all been going through is to bring in new information, new values, new beginnings, new opportunities. And when I say opportunities, if you've been watching my readings for a while, I mean challenges and difficulties because opportunities is, is another way for us to view those type of things. So a, 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 a challenge or a difficulty can be viewed as an opportunity for growth. So all this new energy, it's springtime now. So we have new, a new season. So there's all this new energy coming in. We're going into Aries season now as well. So new zodiac sign, new season of, of uh, of energy and it's a fire energy and as you can see this devil card has a lot of fire energy so what we're seeing is this reminder or a kind of a it's it's almost like a confirmation or something to further instill those new values with the new incoming information. So when I first said this, this is communication, new information coming in. It could be the fire energy. It's something where we just have to try to balance. And this Libra full moon lunar eclipse that's coming in is further ushering in new energy for releasing. <laughs> because the full moon is about releasing and the Libra energy is wants us to recognize where one way of thinking about our partnerships, relationships is ending and a new beginning, a new way of viewing our relationships, our partnerships is coming into play. And it could mean that this Aries energy is a maybe a little fiery. It could be new passion is coming into your life with partnerships uh, it could mean that there is um, possibly sparks flying with relationships, um, partnerships. So, um, and it could be romantic sp sparks, or it could be something where you want to end and move on to something else. But there's a new relationship that's forming, partnership, and it could be e also with inside yourself. It could be a burst of energy with inside of you, fiery energy to fuel your own passion to do what you love, to 
make your dreams come true and give you that spark back in your life. So there's new energy coming in and the six of coins is trying to trying to show you how you can balance these two, this new incoming information and the fiery energy that comes with it by, and it's coin, so it's physical. It wants you to take that energy and fuel it from within so that it, it branches outward and then it helps you in your physical reality. But most of all, this is a physical, physical change with the six of coins that's trying to be balanced right now. So it's that, it's that saying, as within, so without. So you've been doing all this inner work, and now you're going to be looking at to be manifested outwardly in the, form, in the form of relationships and partnerships with this Libra full moon eclipse, lunar eclipse. So that's what I'm kind of seeing. We're entering into this eclipse energy. We have this one coming up on March 25th, and then we have the real big one, um, coming up on April 8th. So we're in eclipse season. And so things change and things kind of happen. And it's ushering in new energy, new ways of thinking, new ways of being, your new energy. All right, everybody. Hope this helps. I hope you have a great day. Talk to you soon. Bye.